Um, hey. Hey. How you doing? Haven't you shown yourself your face, your beautiful scaly wings at just the perfect old time? Guys, I was standing here about to start recording today's video. I look up and this guy is right above my base. A sand dragon. I had one of these guys a long time ago. Right at the start of this series. Oh, about midway through the series. Unfortunately, it died. I can't remember by what means. But these guys are kind of special. These guys can be flown, ridden around, and, well, you can fire darts from their back. This guy may be the secret ingredient. The secret, the, 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 the last little piece of the puzzle to help us get our hands on a demonic dinosaur. And uh, I, one that I wasn't expecting to encounter. So this kind of puts a little bit of a spanner in the works. But welcome back. Welcome back to our Mega Modded Survival. Uh, yeah, okay, cool. I need to work out how to get my hands on this thing right now. I actually removed the mod for a while and reintroduced it. So I need to go and relearn some of this stuff. Um, I need 1,500 stone to get the structure, to craft the essence, to tame this guy uh so i'm gonna do that really quickly okay and uh i'll be i'll be back in a jiffy i, I oh my goodness okay this is this is good <laughs> this is not the style that i expected all right i think one more rock will just about do it and i'm pretty sure we got all 1500 uh, i'm gonna need some water so let's quickly grab a water skin uh yep 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 oh, what not enough i don't have any fiber well, look, I could grab my sickle. Wait, hold on. How do I not have fiber? Wait just a second. That is the most bizarre thing in the world. Um, I'll grab my theory for that. This guy here is an absolute machine at this. I can't believe that. How do I not have fiber? That's, that's, that's insanity. Uh, not that one. This one. All right, there we go. Let me grab some water. I got these. I got a... Okay. All right, all right, all right. I can't do it while I'm actually riding my guy right here. Let me get a water skin. Let me, let me get a water skin. There we go. I can feel this thing in the rain. Perfect timing, rain. Okay. Uh, a demonic tame may very well be doable today. All right. And we'll grab ourselves. Wait a second. This is the actual essence. Wait a second. I didn't think I was crafting the essence. I thought I was craft. Wait, what did I just learn over here? Oh, I learned eternal sand, draconic essence. I thought we had to get like a uh, crafting smithy type of thing to then craft this stuff but i guess not um hey that's cool hey saves me a whole entire step we've got what we need to tame this guy it's passive tame all i gotta do is feed it uh the downside is it's got a very small amount of health also i just repair oh that's right i crashed yeah so here's the deal um as per the other day with all of our issues of crashing and all of that we're still crashing so fingers crossed um, I don't know. We can somehow make this happen without any of that again. But I don't know. The way things have been going today, as I've been preparing for, I guess, this video, um, we're still crashing left, right, and center. And I haven't yet found the reason why. It's pain in the butt. I know. But uh, it is what it is. Now, do we have any other sand dragons around? There's two of them. They're both level 100. Well, that makes it pretty easy. This guy looks like he's actually on the ground, or at least not above water. So let's head on over to this guy and see. Nope, you are above. Dang it. <laughs> All right, the other one might be the easier choice then. There's also the rejuvenating dragon. I don't know much about them. Um, maybe the better choice. Who really knows? We'll see what happens in just a second. But I was going to actually try and do like a bit of a dismount land on this guy and try and force feed him the essence it might be a bit of a sketchy one but i'm gonna try and do it anyways if you could just just sit in one spot it'd be great can i just i just need to sit above you for a second this is not gonna work <laughs> uh can you just come back down to the sand please it's literally in your name and i'd appreciate it so so much come over here my dude that was really not what I was looking for. And yep, yeah, cool. Good start. Didn't even die to a demonic dinosaur. Well, it's fine. <laughs> we took our own life today. We are the master of our own destiny. It's as simple as that. So here's the deal. Today, I was planning on doing something a little different. I wasn't looking at going back and trying another shot at the demonic Dilophosaurus. I was looking to go tame something a little different. 
maybe a little bit more superior a lot more better um but if i can make this happen it may change what am i doing that's the one still don't know what those weird items are that i don't recognize that the things that are left on his body is bizarre but i don't know i'm sure we'll get some answers soon now can i try this again oh if you land right here please please ah oh. all right fine I'll just be patient and wait. All right. Didn't have to be too patient, though. We got ourselves a sand dragon. Nice. Uh, now, big question is, I know I had a ton of experience potions at one point. Where are they? I don't know if we need them, but they might be able to just fast track us that tiny little bit. And I get the feeling I might have used them all, which is kind of a shame, but that's fine. So where is old Sandy? Where did he go? Where's my sand dragon? I assume he was trying to... Oh, he's in my base. Yeah, I was going to say, he's probably trying to follow me. Um, so here's the deal. I wasn't planning on... Oh, you're over there. That's a little bit inconvenient. I wasn't planning on going to get a Devonic Dialo today. What I was kind of thinking of doing was uh, going for something a little bit nicer. A Demonic Gorilla. We have one up here in the snow. I don't think I've ever seen one of these spawn on the map, which is why I'm kind of tempted to go and check it out. Um, and you know what? Let's do exactly that. Let's go and see what this thing is all about. We can get pretty close to it by heading over to the blue obelisk. Uh, but yeah, this one wasn't... Oh, oh I wasn't... Wasn't planned. Um, also, what... Is that about... Why did I lose all my vision just then? That's crazy. Uh, okay. So he's down here. Let's just have a look. I just want to see what he can do, what he's all about. It's also freezing out here, so I do need to be a little bit careful. But I do have some levels up my sleeve. That isn't enough to protect me from the elements, unfortunately. But let's keep on heading down. The good thing about the sand dragon is he can also dive around. And there he is. The demonic <laughs> Okay, explosions as big as ever. I am going to save my game. Like I said, I've been crashing still, and we want to avoid that as much as possible. Um, oh, I forgot I can breathe fire on this guy too. Uh, I'm just trying to get my, my spyglass out. 850,000 torpor, 8 kibble. We can make that happen. And far more exciting than a dialo. That part is for certain. The big question is... Well, is he going to, you know, be able to knock me out of the sky? If I could just sit above him and shoot darts down, we could probably seal this. I don't want to get too ahead of myself. Um, but we could. I just don't know the radius on those explosions because it's kind of nuts, eh? Also, that roar is kind of loud. Also, lots of fire. So it's going to be really hard to see him. He's also really fast. But let's just see what a dart does. Doesn't look like it's doing a lot. Okay, he throws rocks. Oh, right. Okay. All right. Uh, also, I got no... I got no uh, stamina. Oh, gosh. I might have just... I might have just said... Uh, uh, is he coming down to me? I'm in so much trouble. Are we good? Are we good? Are we good? I'm just waiting for my stamina to re regenerate so I can get back in the sky. Um... He's really fast. Oh, my goodness. All right. Oh, my goodness. I got up at the perfect time. <laughs> All right. Uh, look, I want to make this happen. But this might just be a little bit of a uh, foreshadowing of what we uh, may do another time. I just crashed. I just crashed. No way. No way. And that is why we saved the game a second ago. All right, so we're back after about eight crashes. Yeah, I know. I don't even know what's going on anymore, but I joined the world and I crashed five seconds later. Let's hope that we can somehow overcome that here. Uh, Gorilla Boy is down there. I've dropped my graphic settings just to see if that helps us out at all, and I'm not really expecting much out of it. Um, but regardless, uh, the, the gorilla, gorilla's chaotic. I am going to ignore him. I am not ready for this. Maybe if I had a higher level sand dragon or something like that, but um, it's just not happening. So we're going to ignore him for the time being and uh, turn our attention back to 
well, I guess the original plan, which was the demonic dialogues. Now, the one from yesterday is gone, but, or last video is gone. Uh, we do have a lot of others to choose from. I'm not going to go too high level because I know how high their torpidity gets. We could just settle for a level 40, but we're not going to do that. There is a level 200 just over here, though. In fact, wait. Oh, hold on. What was that other one I just saw? There's one up here as well. That could be interesting. Very close to the green obelisk. I could almost lure it into the pit beneath the green obelisk. And we might be able to... That there might be something there. I'm actually very tempted to do that, as a matter of fact. Um, but let me just have a look at this guy over here and see what he's all about. See, 450,000 torpor. Okay. All right. It's not crazy. But if I were to head over to the green man, I'm, I wish these guys were... <laughs> when we first... For the, for, for the la first large chunk of this series, these guys were hardly aggressive. Like, barely aggressive at all. It's recently that they have just, like, gotten absolutely crazy and manic and just insane. And they're kind of really hard to, ta uh, to tame. So, oh, I should have tamed one all the way back then. But what are you going to do? Here we go. It's right beneath us. It's actually a good vantage point, to be honest. 490,000 torpor. So, still quite a bit. Um, still dropping big bombs. As expected. But I don't need to touch the ground. I can just sit up here. And this one kibble? That's nothing. That is so cheap. If I can knock it out, that is. Which we're going to try and do right here, right now. Uh, well, I mean, as long as we don't crash, <laughs> maybe, maybe this might be possible. We are up here. He can't get me. Well, I bet you will still find a way because this is what tends to happen. I, I always find a way to die. Let's be honest with ourselves here. He's not happy, though. Not happy. I can't even see him. But we landed a hot shot on him. All right. Hey, hey, hey. It's not this. It's, it's, it's possible. And here I was about to give up. <laughs> After all the crashes. I've had about 12, 13 crashes total today. After all these crashes, I was on the verge of just canning this video. Can in the series. I got him again. I couldn't even see him, but we managed to get the hit off. All right. Okay. It's working. I mean, this. Oh, wow. That dealt like very little torpor. I must have got a headshot with that first one because the two cents haven't been very desirable. Put it that way. Um, I'm feeling safe though up here, oddly enough. It's working. There's another hit. I'm hoping we've got enough darts on us it's just kind of hard to line it up a little bit we got another shot off just then i'm so worried every time he drops an explosion i'm not so worried about us getting hit i'm worried about uh us getting booted from this world that seems to be the the tough part in all of this what i'm aiming for though is a headshot i think it's pretty clear that that first one we landed was a headshot and dealt a ridiculous amount of torpor like 60,000 of it um now i can't even see him all right all right we're way too close we're way too close back it up and then got him that time that is definitely a headshot and we are way too close for comfort oh he actually got me with that one <gasps> we're on fire we didn't get hit by the explosion but the fireball i guess we did come into contact with it so all right, that is sketchier than we want to be seeing. Uh, I'm going to drop a save right here. This is this is going too well to lose this attempt to another crash. Another headshot. Another headshot. <laughs> oh, it's like I've been working on my accuracy or something. He's at 300,000 torpor. There is a chance here. There is a chance. Uh, don't know how that didn't hit me, but I'm very glad it did not. Got him again, but in the butt that time. Not ideal. Not the best shot we could have got, but good enough. All right, all right, all right. Reload this thing, and let's go again. Not a headshot, but he's not targeting us. We well, kind of is trying to, but they're just not landing. I'm not even landing. I missed completely just then. That is disgusting. But that is a headshot. 
We might have found the sweet spot here at last. Uh, nope, I just missed again. <laughs> I just missed again. I am my own worst enemy here. And I missed again. What is going on with this guy's hitbox? Or do I just really suck at shooting? There's the headshot. I think one more dart, as long as I can hit him. And we're golden here. All right, wasn't the headshot. Is it enough to make it happen, though? It might be. No, it's not. That one most certainly is, though. And <laughs> we've knocked out a demonic at last. <gasps> all right. All right, I'm going to wait for all that fire to clear up for obvious reasons. I've still got the kibble on me. Oh, my goodness. We're actually going to, we're actually going to do this. All right, there's definitely no fire. Good. I'm going to save. Just, I don't know. I've crashed too many times. I'm not gonna, I'm not, I'm not about to sacrifice this. Here is your kibble, my friend. And we've got ourselves a demonic dialo. Woo! -wee. What a relief. What an absolute relief. Can I ride you? Oh, we can. I don't even need a saddle. Oh, yes. All right, buddy. You head back home. It is time for me to go and tear this place to pieces. What are our stats looking like? We got 283,000 health. But stamina is not an issue. Oxygen not an issue. Food not an issue. Weight not an issue. Melee damage and movement speed are the two that I want to see. Um, now, man, I kind of want to go and bump my stats back up. My, my, my graphics back up. You know what I mean? Let's do it. Let's go. I want to see this game in max settings. Epic. There we go. And motion blur off. Bam. Let's go crash this game. It just, it just looks better in Epic. It's probably such a minute difference, but for some reason, my brain's just telling me there's a difference. Uh, now let's go and crash this thing. Except this time I don't care because I've, I've done what I need to do and we've secured the bag. Oh, I thought I'd set myself on fire just then, but nope. This guy survived it though. And do three and a half thousand damage? Not enough, mate, not enough. Go find some more. <laughs> And we crashed. Oh my goodness. Okay, so it must be my graphic settings. It must be my graphic settings that are crashing us then. Good to know. We just troubleshooted live on this video. Fantastic. Well, I think it's very clear that what's causing the crashes at this point is, I guess just, I'm, I'm assuming it's got to do with the mod. Uh, I assume it's the effects. It's all the fire, the flames, the explosions, the particles, the... All of that sort of stuff, I assume, just must stack up and just the game hates it. Um, but hey, we get to kill this Alpha Bronto for a second time in a row. So that's kind of nice. <laughs> this time we actually get the one shot on it. I guess the big travesty here and the big disappointment, though, is we're not going to have any... Actually, wait, why could the wild version fire? Ugh! All right, we're very lucky. I, I thought maybe we we're going to set ourselves on fire just then. But the other, the wild version of this was just dropping flame strikes over and over and over. Like, it was it was launching like six sets of the stuff. I can't really seem to do that. It's like a much longer cooldown on the tamed version of the dialo. Not that it's underpowered by any means. I'm pretty sure this could kill absolutely anything on the map. There are no bosses. There is nothing for this guy to really struggle against. Uh, so we've essentially just got the second strongest creature in the game. Assuming the gorilla is stronger. I don't actually know. The gorilla doesn't have a big old fire explosion bomb like this. It just throws a big old flame and rock. But it can fly it, throw it anywhere in this, like, anywhere. 360 degrees, up, down, left, right, front, and center. We nearly got sniped out of the sky with one, put it that way. Um, I don't know. I feel like the dialo might actually pack more of a punch than the gorilla. The thing is, there are still a couple of other demonics. I've never seen them spawn in the world, though. This is the first time I've actually seen the demonic gorilla spawn. Um... But there are some others that I'm really excited to check out. I really want to check them out. Really, really want to check them out. But yeah, I, I guess we're going to have to kind of wait a little bit on that. Or we'll see if one sports in. They're also very close to releasing. Is that my fire? That's. I think it's so. Uh, there's like some kind of tier bosses that are being very close to implemented into the game that are going to kind of gatekeep some of the um, tiers. I think in particular the Hydro and I think basically the Elemental tier is going to be behind a boss similar to what the Supreme mod does. Um, 
but I don't know when those bosses are being introduced. I've just seen some teasers on them and I'm, I was hoping to be around long enough to check them out. But at this rate, we may be done with the series before that happens, unfortunately. But hey, one day if we revise, come back to the mods to experience it all over again in its new and updated state, we may be able to see what becomes of that. Um, anyways, my guy, he's got 36 levels up his sleeve. So let's go and crank the bull into melee damage. And uh, I just realized I'm actually not burning, but I'm hot. I'm dying of heat. I thought I just broke the lighting. <laughs> I kind of did. But I think that's just the uh, Unreal Engine 5 graphics that are getting all funny there. Question is, do I come on over here and risk it all against another one of these guys? You better, you better believe it. You better believe it. Better believe it. Does he take fire damage? He does not. I can't even see where I need to go. There he is. Is he gonna? Yep, I'm taking fire damage now. Am I taking fire damage? I'm just trying to see if I have protection from burning. But if I've got protection from burning, he probably does too. Where is he? I can't even see him. Is he right in front of us? All right, well, I'm not burning, so that's a good start. Yeah, I got right of defense. That's cool. Uh, where is he? I didn't get a kill on him, did I? Unless I did. I did. He's dead. Get wrecked. Yo. <laughs> there we go. We killed a demonic dialo just to top it all off. Fantastic. Now let's get this guy home. So today went very different to what I kind of expected. Also, where's my... There's Sand Dragon. Mate, you flying into the base was an absolute game-changing moment. I didn't think we would have been able to do this without you. We also got to check out the gorillas. So that was pretty sweet as well. Um, but yeah, I'm going to end this one here. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please go ahead and punch that thumbs up. But most importantly, have a fantastic day. I'll catch you tomorrow. Bye for now.